Hi, it's Triple Game 2 again. I'm going to give you a little demonstration today on how to set up a four jaw chuck uh, within a thousand or two and do it real fast. Often people are afraid of a four jaw chuck and just takes more time to set up. They're not, they don't do it very often. But a four jaw chuck is really a lot more accurate than most three jaw chucks, especially older chucks. And uh, here's a couple secrets. First of all, be sure and clean out the jaws. Make sure there's no chips or anything in there. And then I'm taking a piece of ground stock that is perfectly concentric and accurate. And I'm going to put that in there and allow about a couple inches to stick out. And then we're going to make our initial setup here using the concentric circles. And that will get us within a few thousands. Uh, and then we use the indicator. Your real secret here is to use two jaw, two chuck keys. Now don't be cheap. If you don't have two, buy an extra or make one but it makes the job so much easier. So uh, I'm now going to move these back and forth and I'm working in this direction right now then I'll rotate it 90 degrees and again trying to bring them into alignment here semi-accurately using these circles that are machined into the chuck. It looks fairly close and they're just snug now. I'm going to bring my dial indicator up, make sure it's on center, and we'll take an initial reading here. And I'm within about ten thousandths or so. Matter of fact, I'm real close in this direction, just by coincidence, or maybe it's experience. But here I'm about, oh, ten thousandths or so off. Make sure that the jaws are perfectly horizontal now and I'm working one chuck key against the other. Just snug now. And I'll check that and I'm, oh my gosh, I'm within a thousandth on that or a half a thousandth. And then in the other direction here I'm within one thousandth. So I'll bring that back in. This is going a little faster than what I expected. Now at this point it's still just snug and I'm bringing it around and I'm very close. Now I realize you can't see the indicator and you might think that I'm cheating that I did it that fast and I usually don't do it quite this fast but it is easier to, to do using this two chuck key method. So don't discount what I'm telling you. Now the chuck jaws have not been tightened yet so now you want to go around and snug them just a little bit each or you'll throw yourself off now we'll take another reading and there I am I'm within one thousandth I could get it a little closer than that but for the purposes of this short demonstration on YouTube uh, that's going to be close enough but the trick here again two chuck keys. This is a little machinist trick that I learned from an old machinist who happens to be my brother Jan. So thank you Jan and thank you YouTubers for watching. So long. Oh.